Afternoon everyone, it's just me again, Tony. And I'm just doing a bit of a, not an unboxing, just a couple of reviews of the different statues I've got in my cabinet. So, like I said in my last video, it's raining, so I'm not heading up to my shed where I keep all my spare statues and boxes. Um, when I swap them out, I usually do a review then, or if I go over to the young fella's place, check out him, he'll have his channel going soon, that's the young Herman. So you've got to subscribe to him. He's doing the whole beach scene and crabbing around Australia and doing all that, you know. And so I'm going to give him a shout out. So what have we got here? This is a sideshow collectibles piece and it's a little diorama and it's of um, Frodo and Sam and Mount Doom. And that's just the base. So it's small. It's not, it's not a big one. It's nice. That's just a base, it's a rock base. On the bottom, there you go. It's getting focus there. 294 of 300. So yeah, I think this was their first piece that they kind of got, get people in the Lord of the Rings dioramas and that. I haven't got a lot of their dioramas, I've got a couple. It's quite nice, so we'll put it on the old turn style over here. And there you go. <laughs> You can see that, or it might just might be a bit far away or something. No, that should be alright. There you go. We just zoom in here a bit. Just oh, just didn't zoom. Just push the thing in, and there's the base. Quite nice. Going up like up the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's good. Got some good detail. It's only small. side there there you go and what goes on top of it is Sam and Frodo and that's them here just got a peg in the, in the in his foot to get which just holds in he's Sam's carrying him because Frodo's a bit worn out from basically not doing much really that's pretty nice. That's for the ladies. <laughs> and Sammy's old gardener. And there you go. He's got Sting on him. And he's helping his mate because his mates, you know, all tuck it out. And that's what you want to do. Get up a bit close here. Head sculpt. Of course, head sculpt isn't spot on. But it's still pretty good. Better than what I could do. There he goes, there's old Frodo having a bit of a sleep. Unbelievable. And so we'll put him on, put on, put them on. Heading up Mount Doom. I love all this stuff. It's freaking awesome. There you go, look at that. Mount Doom. That's a little closer. Okay, that's pretty nice. I know what scale this is, it's small, so it's not like, I'll just spin him around, Maybe there, some people reckon Sam was the real hero, but you know, it takes a team, not a team, everybody puts in a bit of effort, they're both uh, hobbits, of course, look at that. Nice. It's a really nice piece. Yeah. Not much to say about everybody's probably. Seen. Oh no, a few people haven't seen Lord of the Rings. It's I don't know, not cultured or something. They are. You can't have everything. Have a look at that. The sword. Good detail. Good paintwork. They're a bit dirty. Yeah, I like it. It's really nice. Yeah, he, he, Sam looks a bit angry there. Good old mate Frodo, he's freaking having a bit of a nap. It's beautiful. Really good piece. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, there you go. Another spin around. they good, good, good details on the rocks and all that. The base looks good. Yeah, 
but it's only two pieces about that they have to put together and it's good because sometimes some smaller pieces you haven't got room to put all the big ones in so smaller pieces will pop in between and swipe everything out and yeah beautiful piece well done sideshow quite good of course the dude who played um sam sean bean and i can't remember his name i say but 51st dates is his best movie he was jacked in that movie it looked really good hysterical movie they brought a statue out of that i'd buy that that was that, that's tremendous But yeah, nice piece. Thanks again for watching, everyone. There you go. <laughs> Have a good day, eh? Hey? Cheers.